Hello and welcome to this week's Link to Success e-Bulletin. Now, a few days ago, I was inspired by a short video I saw from Chris Hamilton of LinkedIn Connection in Canada. And he shared some information about a website I was familiar with, uh, but hadn't really used myself. And that website is known as Canva, C-A-N-V-A dot com. Now, Canva is a wonderful site, absolutely free to sign up to, that allows you to create this kind of banner image for your LinkedIn profile. Now, I want you to think about this for a moment. Your banner image at the moment may be the blue standard background that LinkedIn provides you with. Or maybe you've got an image of some kind to reflect your brand. But what if you could really easily, very quickly, create a banner that communicated a very clear message to those people that you want to engage with on LinkedIn? Well, that's what Canva does for you. So let me show you how that works. So I've logged on to Canva, just created an account very easily, and it's canva.com is the URL that you're looking for. And on the left-hand side here, you can see I get an option to create a design. Now, when I click that option, I get lots of templates that I can use for LinkedIn or Facebook covers or Facebook posts. So lots of different applications you can use Canva for. And the recommended for you is based on my previous preferences. But if you come to this for the first time, what you would do is click on create a design. This page will appear and you scroll down the page until you actually find LinkedIn banner. Now I have to tell you, when you create a Canva account, it asks you what type of business you're in. And depending on what you choose, uh, what you'll find sometimes is you don't get quite as many banner options. So I went for social media. Uh, as a marketing as an option that gave me all these options so maybe that's the one to choose for you as well now once I've found the LinkedIn banner as an option it's got the dimensions here of that banner I'm going to click on that that will open up a brand new page ready for me to start to create my image okay so here we are on the page you see a blank screen where I can add a banner image now, immediately you can see that in terms of different layouts, Canva provides you with quite a number of options. But what I actually want to do is create my own bespoke banner. So I'm going to come to Uploads on the left-hand side here, and I can choose to upload a brand new image if I want to from a file. But as I already have one saved from earlier that I've used, I'm going to click on this image here that you probably saw a moment ago I was using on my LinkedIn profile. But what you can see now, of course, is the image isn't, wide enough to be able to fit the whole banner. So in this case, I need to make use of this white space here. Now, what I did in my particular plan was to come to backgrounds over here. And I get all these different background colors that I can choose. And what I chose to do was to scroll down and find a color that most closely matched the photograph. And this was the option that I chose. And immediately you can see now I've got some consistency of look and feel. What's missing now, of course, is the text. Now, to add text, all you need to do is come over to the left-hand side here, and you have different styles of text and subheadings that you can choose from. I'm gonna choose, just as an example, brunch. And when I click on that option, you can see it's sitting here right in the middle of the image. So all I have to do is drag that over to the left-hand side here and click on the word, and let's replace brunch as an option with my company name. So as I type it in there, what we can see immediately is that's too large. So what I want to do is to reduce the font size. So I get that option up here, maybe still a little bit large. So I can just reduce the size of that again. Uh, now, that's what I'm going to show you today, because you probably get the idea that you can drag some text over and put it on the right hand side here and uh, just add as many different pieces of content in there as you want. Once you're finished, all you have to do then is click download and it saves it as a PNG file. You download that to your computer. Then you come back to LinkedIn, come to edit just here. If you don't already have a photograph, when you click on the edit for the banner image, you'll click on add a photo. In this case, I would change a photo, upload it, position it as you would like it to be seen in LinkedIn's dimensions and then click apply and you have a brand new banner image on your LinkedIn profile. So 
great tool to use very quick and simple even for someone who's not uh, that tech savvy as i am and you can get a very clear message across to those you want to connect and engage with about who you are what you do and most importantly how they can get hold of you as well